What is sound designing? Sound designing is a process of adding different types of sounds inside your video so your videos or uh, any film will look more dynamic and it will feel like you are actually there. Usually these sound effects are not that much noticeable in your videos but without them it won't feel like you are actually watching the movie or a professional film. So sound effects are really important part of your film. Not just for the films if you want to be a professional videographer or if you want to be a professional editor you need to learn the basics of sound design hello youtube this is your mayabani and welcome back to my youtube channel so in this video we are going to learn the basic fundamentals of sound designing and we are also going to see what is actually sound designing and how different types of sounds are used inside the professional videos or even in films learning the basics of sound designing and applying the things inside your videos and video making process or editing is going to make only your video better before diving into the detail i would like to ask you guys to subscribe to my youtube channel please leave a like on this video because it takes a lot of time to make these videos so let's start with the sound designing basics so there are totally four types of different sound effects which are used in films first are called risers they start at a low volume and they slowly rise and after reaching a sudden point they drop second is atmospheric sound effect this type of sound effects are going to help you to give more detail about the atmosphere of the video to your viewer and third type of sound effects is whoosh type of sound effects and this type of sound effects are used for usually fast moving things and if something is going really fast uh, inside your frame then this whoosh type of sound effects are used and these sound effects are also used as transition sound effects in your video and the fourth type of sound effects is movement sound effect if anything is moving inside your frame then you, that must produce the sound right anything which is moving produce a sound so that type of sound effects are called as movement sound effect and there are other lot of sound effects which does not get categorized in this type of four sound effects so they are just totally separate and i will explain about that also so let's get deeper into this type of sound effects first let's start with the easiest type of sounds which are the whoosh sound effects as i told you whoosh sound effects are used for transitions of your videos and and suppose something is moving really fast from inside your frame then that sound effects are used over there too and whoosh sound effects are really so much important while doing your transitions of your video that if you don't put that whoosh sound effect that then it is not going to even feel like a transition for example look at this clip without using whoosh sound effect yeah, yeah. i don't want to fall asleep i don't want to pass and now look at that same clip again with using whoosh sound effect yeah, yeah. I don't want to fall asleep. I don't want to pass. Have you seen the difference? Sound effects makes huge impact on your transitions of your videos. It's just simple but you just need to use your mind where you need to put your sound effects and you just need to be creative with it. And remember not to put the sound effects really in high volume because it is just going to ruin your video. Just keep it low and mild. Second type of sound effects is atmospheric sound effect. This type of sound effects give you more detail about what's going on inside the frame and its surroundings. So, so it is just as it sounds. It gives you more information about your atmosphere and this type of sound effects are really uh, simple to use and you don't need to be like to go too creative with it here are some of the examples from my videos in this video as you can see i have added fake rain effect and to match it with the visuals i have also added the fake rain sound effect this fake rain sound effect falls under the atmospheric sound effect and also this lightning sound effect which i have added in the start of that video also falls under this category in this video too in the start i have added natural ambient sound effect and as soon as I transition to another clip, I have added ocean waves sound effect. And as I come over here, I have added fire sound effect. I don't know why this is happening, but I probably this. The third type of sound effects are called risers. This type of sound effects are usually used uh, when there is something important is going to happen inside your film or inside your video the, that sudden drop in the sound effects is used as a breaking point and that point is used as a point which shows the importance of the scene for example in one of my recent videos i did an effect which is like kind of i gets dragged into a paper and then goes to another place 
and to make that scene visually more dynamic i used a uh, riser before i get dragged into that paper here you go with the example So that's how you use risers in your videos and it is pretty simple you just need to put the risers before there is something important is going to happen but uh, just make sure you don't overuse these risers because it is just going to fuck up your video so the fourth and very 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 important and out of these four things very important type of sound effect is movement sound effect so if there is anything anything moving inside the frame then there must be a sound created by it right human ears cannot actually listen to this type of sound effects very clearly but putting this type of sound effects in inside your videos will make your videos really really professional so suppose if i am doing this i am taking this diary and i am doing this of course there is not sound effect but if i put some kind of sound effects under it it will look more realistic right it will feel more dynamic to you guys for example in this sequence of one of my videos you can hear the writing sound effect and that sound effect when i put that pencil over there in normal conditions we cannot hear the sounds but in sound designing we need to put the sounds to make our visuals look more appealing if you are not following me on instagram at direct dive i posted a video about stranger thing effect you must have saw this effect if you are following me on instagram so i have layered different types of sound effects uh, one above another and it made uh, that scene really look beautiful actually go into that scene and they feel it because of the sound effects says sound effects are not there if i am just going to put one or just just suppose one sound effect just lightning sound effect it is not going to feel realistic as it used to do before so these were the four types of sound effects which i categorized on my own and tried my best to explain you guys the basics and fundamentals of sound designing in films and in professional videos the disclaimer of this video is to use this type of sound effects really carefully and at a really low volume because if you are going to keep it really high volume because you want to give that excessive feeling to your viewers it is not going to work like that you need to keep it mild and simple so it is going to feel like more professional or your videos will feel like too much what we call artificial sound designing of course you are going to get better with practice and making different types of videos and uh, using these techniques in your videos and don't worry these are the just basics i am going to make some more videos on sound designing like the advanced tutorials on sound designing where i will be explaining more detailed about sound designing and how actually i do in sound designing in post so subscribe to my youtube channel for that and to get notified when i will put that video so if you enjoyed this video just don't forget to like this video subscribe to my youtube channel and uh, comment down below how was it if you enjoyed this video or not if you got anything out of this please uh, consider sharing this video with your friend yeah that's it for today and i will see you in the next one sano